Hello everybody, my name is Seltrek, play the game Bad Parenting. Let's just play. Let's just see how this game is. Oh shoot, okay. Mom, you're home late again. Come on, I was busy with work. Can you have some sympathy for me? But today is my birthday. Oh, oh, of course. I know that. Yeah, you don't know that. You, you don't. And where's my gift? Damn! I need to don't be so rude. Where's my gift? Uh, mom, have you ever heard of Mr. Redface? On the birthday of good children, Mr. Redface secretly leaves gifts while they are asleep. Really? Oh my god. Of course. If you want to get your gift, you have to go to bed right away. I'm going to bed right now, mom. Yeah. Oh shit, is that my dad? You're fully the kid again. How many times have you come home to this late? I was working and my shift ended late. Oh shit, he looks ugly. You still think I'm an idiot, don't you? Damn. That hey, little shit, get back to your room. Wide open. Sid the sloth. Don't stand here and ear. Eve, Eve's drop. How oh, what? Eve's dropping on grown up conversations? Okay. Sorry, Dad. Oh. Standing so far away, huh? You can go through him. Ha uh -huh. Mom? Hmm. I guess I'm going away then. Just standing there. This is a small house, or I would say big, it looks big. Okay, I guess I'm gonna go to bed then. What's in here? Cannot go in there. The phone. Oh, this is my parents' room. Oh yeah, it's just about to get a divorce. Just get a divorce already. You don't sleeping together even. Get a divorce. Wait. What is the interact button? Perfume. I, I mean, I understand the meaning of this, like, you can just sleep with your own self, but, like, that's not family love, you know? This is my room? It's big! This is a big-ass room. This is bigger than my room. Oh my god. Nighty night. Okay. Oh, God. damn. Storming. Is that my dad? Is my dad coming to beat me up? Am I beat it up? Oh, that's a big guy. Hello. Hello, how are you? Oh, that's a Mr. Redface with a with a doll in his hand. And he's moving real slow. Okay. The flashing was creepy. I have a toilet paper? Why do I have that? And why do you want it here? Okay, I can't open it. Gift? Is that the gift from Mr. Redface? No way! Oh. It looks like me. Hi, I'm Ron. What? You can talk? Of course, because I was created by magic. You even have the same name and appearances as me. 
That's right. My master made me just for you. But your neck seems kind of a bit loose. It's okay. Sometimes my master can make some mistakes. This is just a small flaw compared to the adults. What's important is that from now, I will be your best friend. Oh, thank you. That sounds wonderful. Do you want to play something with me? Hmm. My master stored my toys in the closet. Can you go get them for me? Okay. I can't open it. The closet is still stuck. Can you try that again? Nope. I tried my best. I can't open it. Do you want me to do something else? I'm hungry. You're a doll. How can you even eat? No, you'll be the one eating, but I'll be able to feel everything you eat. My master linked all your senses and emotions to me, so I can easily understand you. Wow, that's amazing. But also at the same time, very creepy. Why are we not questioning the doll? Oh. Okay. A beer for my dad, of course. Okay. You're reading this letter at 1 p.m., aren't you? Sleepy head. I prepared your favorite dish in the fridge, so remember to heat it up before eating. Lately, I noticed you've been getting lazy about eating. You know I don't have much time at home, so please learn to take care of yourself and stop making me worry. One more thing, don't forget to take your medicine after, after eating. Okay. Spaghetti. You're holding something else. Oh, okay. Here you go. You can sit there. Spaghetti, spaghetti. Mamma mia. Italiano. You just standing there. Oh, oh. Thank you very much. You just standing there. Vibing. Somehow. This isn't this dish far away. Okay. Mm. Is that your favorite dish? Do you want to see me perform some magic? Yes, please. All right. I'll make this plate of food never run out. Every time you finish eating, the dish will be restored to its original state. Nom. Nom. Voila. Whoa. That's amazing. What else can you do? Oh, shoot. Sure. You can move that? You can move a beer? Oh. Uh, he's drinking. He's an alcoholic. That doll. Damn, a smack. Mr. Redface. Damn. What? What just happened? I don't know. You guess. Oh, no. A bottle. My dad's gonna wipe, whip my ass. I hope he's still asleep. Your dad? Don't you worry. My master has taken your dad away. What did you say? Oh, the doll is here. Where's my dad? As I said, my master has taken your dad away. Why? Because your dad is a bad person. He often hits you and yells at you. Parents like that are often taken to my master, by my master to protect children like you. But this is too much. My dad doesn't deserve that. He is a bad person. No, he's not. Please let my dad go. I'm begging you, please. <laughs> all right, all right. My master won't like this. It's quite a long way to where your dad is being held. You'll have to use a shortcut if you want to get there in time to save him. Show me the way. The shortcut is through your closet. Hmm. Well, he used the closet when he came to win my gift. Oh, wait, through my closet. Oh, shit. Just pointing at it. I can't open it. You still can't open it? That's disappointing. I guess you have to use your parents' closet. He's just staying there.
You should know that these classes can function as portals. They can take you anywhere you want, including where your dad is being held. Give it a try. Okay. Oh, shoot. There's nothing in here. Oh, right. I forgot. What do you forget? There are a few steps you need to do. Need to take to activate this shortcut. Bring your dad's radio and place it in front of the closet. Okay. Badam, badadam, badam. This radio will work like an elevator button. You need to select the frequency first. If you choose the right frequency, the door will open to the place you need to go. Badam, badadam, badam, badadam. Ooh, it looks lovely. Seems like that's not it. Let's try again. <gasps> Who are you? Okay. Whoa. I think this is the one. Go ahead and step in. I'll stay here and watch out the house. Okay, that is creepy. Ooh. It's a car and a fire, I guess. Why does this cat look familiar? Like, Courage the dog. Can I speak with you? Okay, I guess not. A fire, a car, and a grave. Like I walk upon on. Well, this is creepy. Oh. What's up? I'm looking for my dad. Describe. My dad's name is Bruce. Wait a minute. Wait a moment. There's many Bruce's here. Any more details? Is this Bruce a good person? Good Bruce or bad Bruce? Well, my dad is the kind of person who gets a bit angry. I'm such a child that is just not willing me to say it. So he's a bad Bruce. Let me see. Yeah, there are still many bad Bruce's here. More specifics, please. What else does he do? He often yells. Still not enough information. And sometimes he hits me and slaps me. And that's all. The door is behind you. Oh. A different closet. Hello. Three children. Boo. Aha, he just got startled. Who are you guys? Just like you, we're kids in a, on our way to find our parents. We're staying here for a bit. Do you want to join us? I'm sorry, I'm in a hurry. Okay, see you later. I can clearly see what's the logical of deaths here. She got put in a grave while she was still alive. He was put in the in the trunk, and the dad or mother was driving it like crazy and killing him. And then him, or he was kidnapped, maybe. And then there's him. Uh, he died in a bonfire. This is my dad. Dad? Please stop punishing me. It's me, dad. Please stop punishing me. What has he done to you? Come on, let's go home, or Mr. Redface will take you both of us. Please stop punishing me. Wait. Am I dad? No, am I dead? Am I dead since he's saying don't stop punishing me? What do I do? I think I'm the one who is dead. I think I'm punishing him. Oh, a spell card. Oh my god. Oh, my shoulder hurt. Oh, that's a cute way to wiggle his feet.
Oh, my shoulder hurt now. Excuse me? Hold on. My shoulder has been hurting for the last four years since I got the coronavirus uh, vaccine. Oh, and just because of that jump scare, I got even more hurt. Why are you hiding in this closet? Mr. Redface is taking dead. Oh, well, that's a good thing. Oh, well, that's a good thing then. I'm not joking. It's a long story. Let me explain. How is your doll, Ron, doing today? Is it alright? Doll? Mom, how do you know about it? Of course I know. Since you have taken your medicine, dot, today. This isn't the first time you had such a hallucination. Every time you tell a different story, but the com common factor is always the stupid, a stupid doll. Don't you remember the previous times? No. I don't know what's wrong with you. Why is my mom saying so much what is wrong with you? Just go to bed. It's midnight already. So many sentences with what is wrong with you. The house is... The house is dark. Oh. Oh. Oh, please let me go. It looks like my dad. Oh, shoot. Mom. What just happened, son? Are you alright? My mom at least cares about me, but she still is a bit mean. Oh, shit, the way you look at me. Go stare at something else. That is a creepy look. Do you feel better now? Yeah, mom. It's Mr. Redface. It's alright. Tomorrow I'll take a day off. Stay home. And take care of you. Really? Ugh. Promise me, mom. I promise. Now go back to your sleep. Yes, mom. She is nice at the same time. So, I enjoy that. Mom? So, you've broken the promise again. Where am I supposed to go? Out here? To the door? Hmm. Maybe to my room. Oh, the light, fl the light flicked. My doll. What? <gasps> it's beaten up. So it's basically me, me just dead. What happened to you? My master beat the shit out of me. He wasn't happy what happened about what happened yesterday. I'm sorry. This is my fault. By the way, have you seen my mom anywhere? My master has taken her away. What? It just happened. I'm sorry. I couldn't stop him. You should run away because he'll come back soon to take you too. No, I just I have to save my mom and my dad too. How? Don't you see what he did to me? L look at me, man. Look at me. My goddamn. I got this. Is that a spell card? I found this at my dad's pr prison. I think it might help us defeat him. That's that's a spell to defeat Mr. Redface. Come on, quickly go into the closet to find where your mom is being held. Okay, I'll go now. The cat is gone. Everything is dark. Mr. Redface got really angry, huh? It's my mom. Quickly throw the spell in here and take cover. It's my mother. 
Wait. Okay. Boom. The cover. Hello, children. Mr. Redface is coming through, I think. Oof. Bum. 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 Explosion. Explosion. Oh my god. Okay, I'm supposed to go back then, I think. I'm coming, mom. Mommy. I'm back. What? what? Oh. What's happening to you? My master has been defeated. The magic he cast on me is also fading. Are you disappearing? Don't worry. This is what I wanted. You should go outside and see your parents. Oh. Oh, they're still there from, from the start when they were fighting. But much closer. Hello. Dad? Mom? You're all free now. Of course. You've been having an affair with you, haven't you? I told you I was busy with work. My dad is awfully red. Mr. Redface! <laughs> You've been elected to this family for another man. Aren't you ashamed to lie to your son? I would never have an affair. And what about you? Do you think you're better than him? Than me? You're just at home, leeching off me all year round. What kind of father are you? No matter what I do, it's my business. I still bring money home to support my child. And if you still think I'm a... Something. You're lowering your yourself even below that. Oh. One more word. Fine. You and I will get a divorce. One of us will have to move out of this house. If you're still here tomorrow, I'll take my son and leave. You stay right there. Now, uh... Oh. Dad. Oh, he has the red aura. Just like the Mr. Redface from when we killed him. Oh, he's drinking. He is drunk. And he is dangerous. He is dangerous. Baldy basic looking ass. Oh shoot, that was a long chug. Uh. I won't let this happen. Oh, he's gone. Oh wait. I'm seeing things. I just saw him sit there. That's me. No, no, no. This cannot be true. I'm very sorry, Ron. The closet. I think you're able to open it now. Oh, it's me. Yeah, I, I was right. I was right. I was dead the whole time. This is m me. Why don't I know anything about this? you always known. What do you mean? Because I am the known, knowing part of you. You 
tried to deny and reject these things and made up stories to make yourself feel better about you and yourself and your dad and me. I have to find a way to lead you back to the reality. I've tried many times, many ways to help you accept this truth as easily as possible. And every time I fail, guess what happens? Tick tock, boom. All the memories disappear. You once again wake up at the starting point, which is the night your dad murdered you. How long have I been dead? 14 days? Are you serious? 14 days. Oh, yeah. Crack, 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 crack. In 14 days, I've been cracking those bones in my neck. It can't have been that long. What really happened to my parents? As for your dad, he's hiding in a cheap model room. Motel room. Motel. Oh, nah. Oh, that, yeah, I was right. My dad was being haunted by me. Of my death. I knew it. Go home with me, dad. Come home with me. Come home. Just like the toys from Toy Story 1, when they would come to life, and he, the rude guy was, the rude kid was uh, getting scared. What about my mom? She still sees me, doesn't she? That's right, because she's only home late at night. But if it's daytime, Daytime. Sun? Not in the closet. What about my room? <gasps> I'm getting goosebumps. Oh, I'm getting goosebumps. Am I dead? Like me? Am I am I dead? I'm getting goosebumps. Oh, the police. Or the FBI. Do you have any clues about your husband's hiding place? No, I don't. Ma'am, you dropped something there. What is that? Oh, it's me! When I threw in this spell card for, like, killing the red Mr. Redface, but it's... Something else, maybe. It's a motel card. So I saved my mom. But I'm not sure it's mine. Oh! As me, I'm dead. I'm ghost. And I went into the, my dad's motel room. Stole the card. Went back into that fever dream place. Threw the card into the room. And then my mom got it. Ah... Oh. Killer father arrested. Finally, that bitch ass. I don't know about you guys, but is this anxiety? And traumatizing. <gasps> oh, the child! Hold on, let's hold on. Yep, she was gr set, set in the grave and died. He was burned in a torn fire or whatever it is called. And he was in the trunk getting killed. Then there's me, hidden in the closet and killed. A sad story. That has got to be the saddest story ever, ever played. But guys, is it traumatizing and anxiety at the same time? If I have my ear like this, if I have my head like this, and I'm sitting and playing games or watching YouTube, I never trust my ears to hear something from the outside. So I always have it like this, 
to make sure that I'm hearing my parents. What does that mean? If someone can please tell me. Well, that was the game. I might be traumatized or not, but uh, thank you all for watching this game. Thank you all for watching this video. See you guys next time, and bye bye.